again, uh, ask uh, Kosoku nicely, please deliver your promise. I'm not interested in replying to your personal attacks, saying that I lied. I'm just showing the evidence. Uh, we do not lie, because this is exactly what you said. You did not make the announcement of the figure, but you said, not only in recording, but also in print, that there will be an extraordinary investment for a global excellence center. But the, and the announcement of the sum will be made by the Prime Minister. And the Prime Minister made the announcement of 4 billion ringgit by Motorola. And yet, now, nothing is happening. You can even play ignorant, or you can even pretend to be stupid by saying that, what investment? Where God? This is too important to play games. Huh? I don't want to, to play political games or we want to play any games with him. Any punya permainan tak boleh main-main. Macam harap kosukun jangan main-main lah. Because it's too important. We're talking about 4 billion ringgit. It's not a small amount. But apparently there's no 4 billion. So we want to know what is actually happening. Otherwise, how can the Prime Minister go overseas again to make announcements? which later is found to be not true. I think it's not fair and it's not right to the Prime Minister. If the Kosuku had not said it, then I'll be asking the, the Prime Minister to explain. But this one is not fair to ask the Prime Minister because this is all engineered by Kosuku. So I think it's only fair that Kosuku does write to his own Prime Minister by explaining what happened to the 4 billion ringgit. You have put the Prime Minister into an embarrassing position by making the announcement in the United States and yet later found to be not true. No, because he says what investment, no such investment. In response, he said there's no such investment. No, apparently it's not true. Because when we check up, nothing. No 4 billion ringgit announcement. We hope that I'm wrong. Lah. I just hope that I'm wrong. Or prefer to be wrong and get 4 billion ringgit than to be right and get nothing. You know what I mean? I prefer to be wrong and let Penang get 4 billion, then to be proven right and Penang get nothing. But I think this is all started by Kosukun. Kosukun should finalize this issue. What is happening? What is happening? And this is, I say, too big an amount to play play with. Lah. We have on our, together with Maida, we have achieved uh, the highest investments ever of 12.2 billion ringgit last year. For the first quarter, we have got 1.8 billion. We are hopeful of at least having a minimum increase of 4 billion after the announcement. But so far, nothing. 4 billion is from Motorola. But so far, nothing. Yes, Manchu. Uh, you are aware of the Reuters report. Right? There was a sort of a correction in the Reuters report. One saying that the Motorola, uh, well, it was not exactly denial, but there was a report that came in. Yeah, yeah, exactly. What so far to date that what they had invested was 4 billion. Not a 4 billion new investment. But this is, this is different from what the Prime Minister had announced. But, but you look at the Bernama report, the Prime Minister announced new investments. And it's a 4 billion ringgit investment by Motorola for a global accident center. It's not an existing investment. So if this is not true, please la, clarify. La, because we're all hoping, hoping for 4 billion ringgit that never come. Just like, uh, tunggu durian runtut. Uh, tak, tak, tak jatuh langsung. Masak tak jatuh. So what's happening? After that, complete silence. You know? Complete silence by Kosukun. So can Kosukun please explain? He said that he played a major role. He contacted them some more. I don't know who he contacted them with. Lah. Has he contacted the right person? Lah. He contacted them, he said, got 4 million. And afterwards, nothing. Now, we want all... Uh, Intel has a global excellence center and employs 1,200 engineers. Really a global excellence center. 1,200 uh, engineers and they invested more than a billion US so far. 
It's not new one. I mean, so far they invested since 1990. Almost more than a billion US. That is uh, in that. I'm sure if Intel can do that, other companies can also do that. So we are looking forward to this global excellence center. By Motorola for four billion. And suddenly now nothing. So can can Kosukun please explain? Otherwise, you also put the company into an embarrassing position. So please let us know. What is actually happening? Have you made an announcement that is uh, untrue? If untrue, please say so and please explain to the public. What is the actual investment? And, and then most important, you got to apologize. Ko Sukun got to apologize to the Prime Minister because he misled the Prime Minister until the Prime Minister embarrassed himself and the country by making a false announcement in the United States in front of all the Kuala Uno. You embarrass yourself, are you? You say, I mean, that is not very good for Malaysia. Invite Mugabe, someone. 